You ready? You ready? Uh-huh. We're talking about type 1 and type 2 errors. Type 1 error is when the null is true, but you, re- you reject it. Type 2 error is when the null is false, but you accept it. Let's put that example into context where we're talking about our null hypothesis. Let's just say our null is true. Boom! Okay, and then your alternative is just the alternative. Boom, 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 boom. (coughs) So we're talking about type 1 error and type 2 error in a relationship. All right, so you're going to assume that your girl is not cheating on you. Yeah. You assume that she's true. Okay? So what happens if you assume she's true and she's actually cheating? Which kind of error is that? Yeah, you assume the hoe true, but that hoe cheat. So your hypothesis is false, but you accepted it. That's type two. So if she's actually, che- if she's actually cheating on you and you stay with her, that's your second type of mistake. That's type two. But, what if you assume your hoe is true, but you reject that hoe anyway? Yeah, what if, well that's, I hope this never hits the internet. Okay, (laughs) so you're assuming she's not cheating on you, but you dump her anyway, because you have insecurity problems or something. (laughs) Yeah, that's your first problem, insecurity. Sure, so if you actually reject a true hoe, that's type one. And that's type one and type two error.